tell me a little bit why the decision was made to go to Australia. Dave? We asked the community. The community wanted us in Australia. All signs really pointed to Australia, and uh, it was just a matter of time before Dave and I flew out there and uh, confirmed what we had, what we had found online, which was that really Australia was going to be a perfect fit for PAX. Australia, having a PAX. Non-stop. Non-stop packing it up. PAX don't stop. Uh, all right, so we're going to do a Q&A. Uh, we've got all the A's. We just need Q's. Hold, hold on. Also, we're glad to be in Australia. Oh, yeah. Hey. <laughs> it's like as, as soon as we come to a place and then they shut the lights off, we sort of enter into this nega realm. <laughs> There's this other place that we travel to. But we've had a tremendous time in Milburn so far. Uh, I can't wait to experience this some more. One of the big reasons Australia was a good fit was they didn't have a show like this. And I think the UK already has some incredible gaming shows. That's not to say that I don't think PAX would be well received, but Australia had, had nothing like PAX. Um, and, so it, and there's a ton of gamers, so it seemed like a good fit. What's going on? So. <laughs> Pika P, Pika, 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 P. Pika, Pika, and so forth and so on. Ah, Pika, P. Um, when you were coming to Australia, what plans yeah. did you make to deal with drop bears, if any? See, I know all about your drop bears. <laughs> all right, I know all about it. I know, I know 100% of the drop bear information. I, I was surprised to learn that there is an official page from the Australian government about drop bears. <laughs> So that, I was talking to the Omega Nuts before, like that extends Australian drop bear trolling like to a global <laughs> level. Like, so you have to understand. When so the government is in on the, it? Oh, yeah, 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 at the highest levels, right? But I mean, so this oh, is- Oh, Jesus so this, <laughs> <laughs> It's a very strange location. We are at the, uh, the no, showgrounds, showgrounds yeah. which is generally used for like horse shows, so there's stables, big open grass fields, tents, and it feels very much like a sort of a uh, state fair or something like that, right? Robert, you know, came down and looked at these spaces and somehow he was able to see how PAX fit in here, and it does. It but does. I, I don't know that I would have had the vision to, to look at these horse stables. And say, hey, you know what, how about a consumer Let's put PAX show. in there, yeah. yeah. That wouldn't, it wouldn't have occurred to me. I had two pieces of toast with peanut butter and jelly. Nice. Yes, I know that I'm supposed to eat, I know that I'm supposed to eat Vegemite. That's what I had. <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody have any right now on them? Here, bring it. Come up here. Can I have it? 
I thought it was like an industrial lubricant. No, no, wait, this, uh, all right. hold on, hold on. This is like your lunch. I, I, how many Vegemite sandwiches do you have? Four. <laughs> all right, all right, let's, can I, all right. There was a smell. <laughs> let, me smell it. let me smell it. Guys, there's a smell on the sandwich. Here. <laughs> all right, so just a bite, just like, Right, yeah, yeah, it's a trap, I know. I know what this is, this is... So much bigger. <laughs> God, I could. You know what's so interesting is that people are like, well, we hope that you'll come back. And it's like, no. Of course we're coming back. This is a pack now. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's like, dude, you don't, like, this is not an experiment. Yeah, I and mean, if there was like, one word that we keep using to, for the vibe, it's grateful. Like, everyone is just, the first thing they do is say, thank you for coming here. I spent some time walking around Tabletop. Um, yeah, I did too. Last night, and it is identical. It's the same person. It's the same nerd. <laughs> like, we're all, like, that's what's the weirdest thing is you can fly... 8,000 miles or whatever around the globe right. and everyone still just wants to play Ticket to Ride. I mean, <laughs> you just want to have a good time. Well, that's been, the, that's, that's been the theory since the beginning of the show that, that there exists a shared culture of shared experiences based on these games that is portable from culture to culture. Yeah, it just doesn't matter where you are. I think that's what we realized. Yeah, we have something to talk about. And PAX, PAX is something... They have to bring PAX. Like we can set up all the we can set up all the shit. We can put the tables out and <laughs> set up the booths, but they have right. to bring packs and they do every yeah. time. Come on, stand up, join me and let's shout and change us and be happy. It's okay to have views that are not like mine. Don't try or lame attack me, please. It's a fire that we love that makes us shine It's what makes us greater than the bees Bees, come on!